Hi, this is Michael with Skechers Performance here at Hollybird Sports to review the Skechers Performance new Hyperburst technology. The Hyperburst technology starts out in a small mold just like what I have here in my hands. It starts in a firmer state and then following two more steps after that, we pressurize it, heat it up, and bake it to what you see right here in my hand. So this is a men's size 9 and this is a men's size 9. From this up here, we actually compression mold it into what you see as the final product right here in the Go Run Razor 3. The Hyperburst technology is extremely lightweight, sets us apart from a lot of other companies out there with their midsole technologies. It's really durable and it's super protective for the runner's foot. It's the same durometer of foam from heel to toe, so you're getting consistent cushioning, whether you're a heel striker, midfoot striker, or forefoot striker. The other benefit to the Hyperburst technology is that the shoe itself isn't affected by temperature as much as traditional EVAs. So whether you're running in the summertime, the shoe is not gonna get soft on you, or if you're running in the wintertime, the shoe is not gonna get, get firm on you. It's gonna stay in the same barometer, same cushioning level, no matter what season you're running in. Offering you great cushioning, protection, and just all around a great run. The Hyperburst technology debuted in the Go Run Razor 3. The technology will be incorporated in other models coming out throughout the year, including the Go Run Max Road 4 Hyper releasing in August. Be sure to check them out at hollabirdsports.com. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up. And make sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all the latest news and information with Hollabird Sports and Skechers Performance.